so at the store, um, we went and bought two Pokemon Go items. While we were recording this, this is the release date for it, but we're gonna keep that sealed. We're opening this today. An Elite Trainer Box of Pokemon Go. Set. When I first heard about this set, I didn't really believe it. And then, here I am now, opening it on the channel. But, there's 10 booster packs, which means there will not be a booster box of this. We have this, which has been never, which has never been seen before in an Elite Trainer box for the Pokemon Go collab and the TCG. We got a player's guide. And then, we got our big deck of energy cards, some Mewtwo sleeves, which we'll, we will be using to sleeve our cards, the poison and damage counters, the like deck dividers, the um, code card, the dice, and then a V-Star marker. And you may be wondering, is that it? No, because of course we have Mewtwo V Flirt promo. And then we have our 10 Pokemon Go booster packs. So we do not take these cards out of the packaging because they're pretty nice. And so it, we would like to keep them that way. We have the sleeves out, and we will start opening these booster packs. So we're starting off with a black bordered toad, and if you don't know what that means, and Fusion Strike or like later excluding celebrations, if you um, get a card that well a code card that has a white border you're not going to get a hit and then you will oh the hits are already coming in but that means you will get a sorry a hit from the pack if it's black border so, one pack in, we've already got a Dragonite V-Star. Another black border code. And when I mean black border, see those borders, like, on the end. If those are black, then that's good. Um, I did not really know that they had the Pokemon Go stamp on it. That like reminds me when it's like um, the pre-release cards, um, except the sets that don't like don't have the. I'm just like slipping up, but the sets that have ten packs in the elite trainer boxes and don't another that and don't have booster boxes for them normally will um will not have these cards that have these stamps on them but this card has the stamp well um we got the stamp Moltres and Articuno We still got six packs left. It seems like we're not not gonna get a black border. Oh, I just realized something. It might be like, sh not Shining Fates. It might be like Champion's Path. Well, when you'll all so you'll always get a hit. 
like you'll always get a hollow rare or better. We got a Mel Metal V. So I'm gonna get my sleeves out and I'm going to sleeve it. And so far, we've got two hollows, Articuno and Moltres, and then we've got Dragonite V-Star and Melmetal V. So we're, we have a pretty good start. Um, judging by the Mewtwo sleeves, the Mewtwo on the pack art, and the Mewtwo pretty much everywhere on the sleeves, the deck dividers. I'm, assu I'm assuming you have probably figured out. Um, uh, yes, I did the card trick different this time. But I always forget what I'm talking about. We got double banger Charizard pack. That is, I don't really... <laughs> That's insane. Um, let me get the sleeves out. So we pulled a Radiant Charizard, which I will be showing on the screen right now. And a Charizard Hollow card. So that is a Charizard Banger Pack. And we still got like, after this we still have half of the ETB to go. Or Elite Trainer Box. Yeah, it's definitely, I think, a guaranteed holo hit because, like, otherwise, like, I'm probably the luck. I feel like I would be the luckiest person on the planet. But Bulbasaur, Numel, or Numel, I'm not sure how to say it. Tranquil, Larvitar, um, Energy, Zatu, Launch, Soul Rock, Blastoise, which has a Radiant card as well. And uh, I, I, I know what you're thinking. Then why isn't there a Venusaur? There is. There, there is a Venusaur Radiant card in the set. And those Radiant EV boxes only have eight packs in them, and they're like, oh, like five. They're like five dollars more than the ETB. So only, I'm, I'm just gonna try to, you know go through these kind of faster but they do they do have I, I don't know why I keep forgetting what I'm saying I just don't know but that Mewtwo card is just like the only thing I'm looking at is just that Mewtwo We got, I've got cards to open, and I'm assuming if you're watching this, you wanna watch me open cards. But I joined the TCG pretty recently, only in 2021. And it's been kind of hard since COVID. Uh, I'm not sure what happened. Okay, now we got the Reverse Hollow and Hollow Blastoise. Got two packs left. I feel like we've like only been getting Hollows now. And I'm gonna do the card trick different again. Just four to the front, which is the usual one people do. But normally I do four and then two there's another why are there so many camera ops? um four from the back and then put them ahead of the next two um i really like the set logo which it, the camera if it can focus you can see which you can't it just looks like two pokeballs since you couldn't see it Okay, now we got all the full trio. 
this down to the last pack. But it says go with Pokeball symbols. So that's nice. Now everything else was not focusing because it was trying to focus on that. Can we have some last pack magic? It, it was white bordered. We got another Pikachu. Squirtle. Melmetal. Bidoof. That is the most insane magic art card I've ever seen. Water energy. Jupiter, Candela, Slowbro, Rare Candy. Now, I do like Lapras, but I think we could have gone a little better. But we, these were our hits. So we pulled, well, this is from newest to oldest. We pulled Lapras Hollow, Venusaur Hollow, we pulled Blastoise Hollow. We also pulled the Reverse Hollow. Well, I guess I should not be considering the Hollows as hits because you get them guaranteed, but we got Melmetal Hollow. Okay, it's trying to slip out. We got Gal Galisopod Hollow. Charizard Hollow, you can already see it. The Radiant Charizard card we pulled, which in the, was in the Charizard Banger Pack that had double Charizards. We got Articuno, we got Moltres, Hollow cards, then we got Malmetal V and Dragonite V-Star, which we pulled on our first pack, and then this was on our second. Would I recommend this? Um, if you're trying to get some basic V and V-Star cards and some Radiant cards, sure. But if you're trying to get the really valuable stuff, maybe go for, like, well, you can still try the ETB. I've never opened any other products. This is my first time. But I would say probably maybe go for a different product, like the EV box, except that's very expensive, or the box that I have in the background, the Alolan Executor box. But I will see you in the next video. Bye.